Hey guys, um, it's about 10.46 at night, and so I shouldn't probably be talking too loud, so sorry if you can't hear me, I might subtitle this. I probably won't because it'll take too long. Pretty much I'm going to um, give a bit of my 2012 story, and that I'll just cover some of the things that impacted me most over the past year, well, the last year because it's the 2nd of January in New Zealand, if anyone from overseas is watching this. I made it into a Facebook status, so I'll read you that, probably give you more detail. My father died in February, and people that didn't know this, like, didn't care, and people that knew cared, but didn't, and then people that I was close to cared, and I got a job at New World, and um, that was, that was cool, and that was like four months after, so just in like June. But in between, those two years, in between those two things, my, uh, one of my friends, she moved away. She was who I talked to because she had a lot of the same things in her life, problems that I did, and that, that hurt too. More recently, I've felt how it feels to be misled, lied to, and cheated on. And, um, so yeah, I've had an overall crap year. The bad outweigh the good. So I'm one of those people that's genuinely hoping for a better year, 2013. I also want to say there was a lot of good things that happened in my year. I just you don't remember the good things if there's a lot of bad things going on. You remember the good things if they outweigh the bad things. But um, yeah, in my case it wasn't. But good things that happened. Um, I. a lot. <laughs> wow, that sucks. This is going to be like the second take on the video to add in the stuff that I liked about this year or the past year and I actually can't think of anything. <laughs> um, I went to a wedding. I joined a gym, I read a couple of books, I downloaded a lot of movies and music, I changed taste of music, so that's probably a good thing because I think it's really good shit. And um, I gained a, a little more trust in people, yeah, well that kind of changed again, back to bad things. <laughs> And I, I hope all of you guys have a great year, a really awesome year, and just, just stay strong. Like, people don't control you, you control yourself. If you're happy, just be happy, and if you're sad, you need to show that. Don't go all internal and keep it inside, because that, that really fucks you up, honestly. That's, um, I did that, and that just wasn't a good idea. And so, when I did that, I had, um, what I had, I always had, I had two psychologists, I went through like four of the different counselors at school because I really didn't like them. I'm only starting just to like the one that I have currently, or had currently, I'm not sure if I still have next year. Um, you need to know that you don't need to change for anyone, you don't need to change for girls, well, if you're, if, you don't need to change for girls if you're a guy, you don't need to change for guys if you're a girl, you, um, you don't need to change for anyone that you're interested in, that's, you need to be yourself and if they don't love you for you then fuck them, it's not worth it, um, love who you are, don't, don't try to be someone else and don't hate yourself, if you hate yourself then maybe change something else, but only change if you want to, you know, don't, don't change that, probably made a noise, you probably heard it, you might have stopped recording the video, so it's gonna fuck me off, I have to redo this, oh, something that's going on recently, um, Logan King, if you're watching this, you're a good guy, and you're you're really cool. Like you're the man. Um, also, if um, it's not really a shadow video, but yeah, just Logan. Logan, you're cool. Like you give good advice. Alright, you give the best advice. Caleb, your, your advice is a bit shit, but um, <laughs> it's it's getting there. So yeah, to everyone watching this, I hope you have a great year, and um, just. Love who you are, 
and um, don't change for anyone.